I feel as if there are people backed up watching us to make sure that we are not going to be hurting their their area, their their land, but they're very welcoming. Um, I also feel like the um, the language is not English. I'm having a, um, a, a rough time understanding that. I can tell you that they're very excited that we're here and we're curious. Um, and I really would like to go deeper and deeper. It's like they want us to keep going. It's like, can you smell too? I don't feel like they're stuck cooking. Hmm. I feel like I want to go probably a quarter of a mile. That's where I want to go deeper into this. I don't know if you can validate this or, um, but did they, did somebody plant these trees like this? Yes. Can you see what's going on? I mean, it's like they want to bring us in here. Yeah, that uh, definitely didn't plan it because of the way. Also, I wanted to talk about the fact that we've got like a cemetery around here and there's babies that are in it and we've got adults. Okay. So, um, but this is so joyous. I mean, they're so excited that we're here yes. to, um, understand how they lived and how I'm being hugged. I'm being absolutely embraced. There's the elders that are um, all sitting down and the younger ones are being told to respect. It's What's really incredible is that I want you to know it's like they know we're arriving and it's like they're having a celebration, like they're cheering us. It's almost like we're at the finish line right before you get in. Um, They've been cooking for a long time. I can smell fat. Um, it's meat. <laughs> There's a beautiful yellow butterfly that comes to also greet us. Um, that's wonderful. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful this little is. It's like they want us to really um, see how they lived. And it wasn't, it isn't like nomads or they're poor. Or they're very happy people and very, they feel like they're rich with love and rich with music. And the food is abundant. Yes. Um, I also know that they're talking about the men must have been away on some sort of adventure. And they, I know the men just came in on the boat or wherever that, the boats that they made. And it's, they're, they're coming, they've come home. And there's a celebration, but it's a celebration of the, how can I explain this? Because it's like a birthday, but it's more importantly that um, they want to celebrate the fact that they're family. It, as we would know, like Christmas, that we all gather family or Thanksgiving, that we do that. This is what they do. Um, and I feel like it's once a year that they bring everybody together and they um, celebrate all oh, these rich foods. The berries we've got, my mouth just watered. Um, yeah. And it's as if they want us to come sit with them. I'm now seeing the men. They're also in like a semi-circle. And, um, they're smoking. Um, but it's not tobacco and I don't feel like it's a drug. I just feel like, um, there's one woman that is, I'm going to, say like she's the matriarch she's extremely old she can't walk on her own and she is not saying words to me she's more of, as if she's like grunting like coming as coming forward it's like she wants to hug us she wants to touch us she wants us to know that we're welcome here oh she just said you could stay as long as you want she says we'll be very safe here no one will be hurt there's we're we're being very protected right now um i feel it like i'm all lit up um goose goosebumps god bumps all lit wonderful. Um, also, there's some sort of, I know we heard that bird, but this is, is there monkeys here? There, there might be. I mean, there's monkeys in the area, so. Okay, there's monkeys that, um, it's just cool, because I can see the monkeys. Um, also, I... It's like they want us to recognize where they've put to rest all of, you know, their families. Um, and I feel it's uh, a very sacred place of where they're buried. 
but I feel like I'm closer to the water. I don't know how far I am from water right now, but um, yeah. So this is wonderful because um, they want to, I know we're going to take a drive around, but they're going to bring us to a couple places that we, we'll get out and be able to understand. So yeah, I also feel like there is um, like cows, but I want to say like bulls or something, some sort of unique, not a basic milk cow. I've got something very unique. Do you understand that? Okay. Um, yeah. I, I will show you some of them alive. Now yeah, there's music right now. So they're playing music. So, um, yeah, they're just appreciative that we're here. It's funny because the kids all had to stay away. They greeted us and brought us in. But now the, this is about adults and it's about respect and that we are respecting their land and respecting um, their life. And they're just so happy. And they are appreciative that we don't destroy the earth. I know that sounds very, but this is, this is their home. This is what they respect. And we don't understand in our time of respecting the earth. And we're talking pollution. We're talking, they don't, I gotta tell you that this man that's talking to me is um, saying he doesn't understand why we need to have all of this material stuff. It's only weighing us down. It's only, um, he says life becomes simpler for all of us. And I mean, I'm talking about us, that we we no longer need to have the weight on our back of carrying unnecessary things with us. <laughs>